Okay, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to connect to your Xbox Live through a cable modem. There's your modem. When all lights are on, and notice the middle one's not blinking, the middle one is a link button. That lets you know that you're connected. So once I connect the co uh, Ethernet cord into my 360 and turn the 360 on, that middle light should light up too. So okay. Ethernet cord. Make sure your cable is connected good. Make sure your power cord's in and it's connected into the wall. Make sure everything's connected. All right. Okay. Now you want to pick your modem up, and somewhere on the back there'll be a tiny little reset button. If you can see right to the right of my Ethernet port, there's a little tiny circle. You see that? Um, what you want to do is you want to stick like a pin or a piece of pine straw or just something in there. And then we do that, this is what's going to happen. Just find something to stick down in here. Okay. I'm going to stick this piece of straw in there. As you see, all the lights are off. There's just one light blinking. Take your Ethernet cord, hook it into the back of your 360. Now all you can do is wait. Okay, all the lights are on. That's just to let you know that it's connecting. See how the two lights are blinking? And uh, a, a new light should pop on about every four or five seconds. See, there goes that third, fourth. Now what you can do is you can go ahead and start turning 360 on. And you see the modem, almost all the lights are completely on, and there we go. The middle light should be blinking, all the rest should be on, you're good. Turn on your 360. Sign in. Sign in to light the blunt. And there you go. It's on. So yeah, that's all you need to do. Once you do that, you should be good. You should be able to connect the Xbox Live. Once again, my gamer tags like the blunt. Hit me up. We'll play.